Okay, so I got ready in a hotel room this morning and my hair is just not quite right. It got blown around by the wind, so just don't judge me, okay? Hello and welcome to my channel. My name is Kate Swan and I like to talk about luxury, fashion, accessories, mostly handbags. So if you're into that kind of stuff, feel free to subscribe and join our luxury family over here. I upload every Sunday and every other Wednesday I add like a bonus video, you know, just a little something extra. But today we are doing a bag reveal and if I look tired, it's because I absolutely am tired. It has been a long week. And then Sunny and I just did a trip to San Diego that was like a little bit over 24 hours. And you know, trips like that are always crazy. We went for a concert. The concert was really fun. We had a great time. And then we spent part of the day there earlier. It's only an hour from us, so it was nice and easy getting back, but we were out until like two in the morning. And then we got up early to go to this breakfast place, which was adorable. It was just, it was a really cool experience, but we had to wait like two hours or an hour and a half to get into breakfast. And then um, ate, did all of that stuff, and then went back to the hotel. We went and visited Point Loma, and then we came back and we just got here. Like when I tell you that we just got here, like I literally walked in the door, grabbed my camera, grabbed the ring light, and set this up because I needed to film this video for tomorrow because I want you guys to see what I got. I've already used it, but I have another Chanel unboxing, and well, a Chanel reveal. And it's surprising for me because I just unboxed the Chanel bag and it was the extra mini. Um, I'll link that video as well if you wanna go see it and you missed it. But I just got that bag recently and now I got another one, but it's a small one. And I have been actually thinking about getting this one for a while. The extra mini, to be honest, was more of an impulse purchase than anything because it was an extremely good price. This one, I was actually waiting to try and find a good price on it. And I found one on Rebag. So I'll discuss that in a second, but let me show you guys what I got. So we have the gorgeous Chanel wallet on chain. This is a bag that I've thought about buying for years, and I decided that it was too small for me. And in one of my recent videos, I said that I am going to have to get some like crossbody small bags for things like going to concerts, going to clubs, going out, um, bars, restaurants, things like that. I was going to have to get a small bag, especially for when we are out of town um, in places where I don't want to like bring my bags with me, bring my larger bags with me, um, or like I'm worried about like leaving them in the hotel room. So I need something small that I'm going to actually keep on me the whole trip. And that is why I got the Chanel Wallet on Chain, and I got it in the color black, which these prices pre-love. First of all, you know I buy everything pre-love. This bag is from Rebag. I've been purchasing from Rebag quite a bit lately, and I, I've i been loving them a lot, okay? They've been having some deals, and it's because of their, like, um, they'll have, like, 20% off or 15% off of the price, and that's why they're a good deal. Anyway, I decided to get it in black because I knew that that was going to be a classic color that no matter what trip we were going on, I was probably gonna be wearing black. You'll see me wearing black in almost every video. And I just wanted something that was gonna be like a little bit just chill, just something that just kind of blends into my outfit, nothing crazy. And it worked perfectly for last night. So I'll show you guys the outfit that I wore with it. And I think this was just the perfect occasion to try it out. Um, I am extremely happy with this bag and I'm also extremely happy with the price that I paid for it. These on Fashion File, <laughs> for um, the like decent condition, condition maybe like this. The black with silver hardware, like it's not, I haven't seen them in good condition under $3,000 and a lot of times they're more expensive than that. So like 3,700 was kind of the range that I saw them in. And I was like, no, <laughs> I'm not paying that much. Uh, it's a wallet on chain and then I think that the I don't remember what the actual retail price is right now I'll put it on the screen, but that was quite a bit as well And I uh, last time I went to the Chanel store the line was so long It was Chanel at South Coast Plaza and the line was so long that I didn't even go in I just didn't want to <laughs> to be honest and I Felt like if I stood in a line for like 45 minutes and then I didn't have the wallet on chain I was gonna be like oh man, but yeah tracking it down doing all those things. I was like, I don't want to go through that so I went on I went on Rebag and I was like stalking Rebag for a while then I kind of gave up on it and then I happened to go on again. I got a, actually got a coupon message saying that I had like 20% off or 15% off and I went and logged in and I looked at all the bags and I saw that they happened to have the Chanel wallet on chain in black 
caviar leather, which is what I wanted. I didn't care silver or gold hardware. I didn't really have a preference. And the bag was about $2,700. Now, I had the coupon, so I used that. And then I also had some points from purchasing with them before, which also gave me another, I think, like $100 or $50 off. So after everything, like after tax and everything, I ended up paying about $2,250 for this. And I think that that's a pretty good deal considering what I've seen other places online. Um, and I'm really happy with it too. The condition is pretty good. I think that it's really good actually. There's not like a, I know with caviar leather, it's really nice because you don't have that same scratching issue, but you don't really see wear on it. Like I don't see a ton of wear, like it is like crinkly on the bottom, but I'd imagine that that's how like all of them are gonna look over time. And they like, they come like, not like like this, there's stuff in here. So they, they don't come like this, they come flat. So I guess it would all have that. I think it's in great condition. Like I think it's, I think it's actually really, really good. There's some scratches. You're not gonna be able to see it, I don't think, but there are some scratches on the hardware, but they're not very heavy scratches. Like it's nothing that I would, that would bother me. And it's, it's not really all that noticeable. It's just normal wear and tear scratches. But yeah, I'm extremely happy that I got this at that price. I feel like that's a fair price to me. Um, also, I know that I'll be able to resell it if I don't end up using it that much, but I doubt that because I used it over the weekend and it has been great to me. I'm gonna just, I have some stuff in here, but I'm gonna take it out. I might do like a what fits inside video later. So in here, I have this. This is the Walk Saver. It's from walksaver.com. I got it on Etsy actually, but um, that's the brand. So I got this for the bottom, honestly, because it was recommended in a bunch of different YouTube videos for this bag. And I was like, all right, you know what? I'll bite. And basically all it does is just keep it from being super flat. It opens up the bottom and keeps the sides open. This just makes it easier for me to put things in here. And I, I kind of like that. I like it a lot. Um, I didn't really know if it was gonna be that functional, but I kind of like it. I also just kind of like how it looks when the bag is empty and it has the walk saver in it. Um, I don't have a box for this bag, so I'm not gonna be storing it in a box or anything. I'll just be keeping it in the dust bag when I'm not using it. And I really kind of like that it just stays open like this. I don't know why. Um, I don't know how important it is to have this in your bag, but I really like it. All in all, I am thrilled with this new addition to my collection. I feel like I'm kind of like rounding out my collection a little bit now because all I have are larger bags and I had sold all my small bags. Um, and now I'm like, okay, I do need something like this. I have my, like I said, my extra mini, which is great. I think that's like a daytime I love it for like daytime use. I think that that's what I'm probably gonna end up using it for because it is a bright color. Um, and then this one I can use for like nighttime evenings and nights out. So I think that that is, I think it's a really good addition to my collection. I think it's kind of like rounding things out and I'm really happy about that. If you guys have the wallet on chain, let me know in the comments if you like it, if you don't like it, if you had one but you sold it because I like hearing about those stories too. So definitely let me know. I love to hear all of it. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you wanna see more videos like this one. Also, if you wanna come follow me on Instagram and join our little Instagram family, I post a lot there and I make a lot of stories and I feel like my stories are kind of fun, so you might like it. I'll put my Instagram on the screen. And if you're not done watching, I'll put a video up there so that you guys can, you know, you might, you're already here. You might as well, you know, check out some other videos too while you're here, you know? I mean, why not? <laughs> I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.